Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Bachelor. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please subscribe and keep watching for more details videos. Jen Tran spills what viewers didn't see during car confrontation. Things got heated between two suitors on the Bachelorette season premiere. Jen Tran reveals what viewers didn't see. Keep reading for all the details. Bachelorette contestant tries to impress with pricey car. Contestants on The Bachelor shows come up with the most unique ways to introduce themselves to the lead and audience on the first night in the mansion. Jen Tran's season of The Bachelorette premiered on July 8 with some of the most unusual entrances. One contestant, Jonathan, showed up on a stretcher wearing nothing but a hospital gown and bandages on his face. He said he was covering his face so that Jen could get to know him on the inside, not the outside. But there was one part he forgot to cover up, his behind. He mooned Jen as he walked up the steps into the mansion. Another contestant, Jeremy, drove up to the mansion in a hot red sports car. He told Jen that muscle cars sometimes give the impression of overcompensating, but assured her he had a big P asterisk -ness. She told us weekly that Jonathan's gimmick was one of her favorites. I would definitely say the cheeky little entrance was a good one too. I was not expecting anybody to be naked. He was naked under there the whole time. It was quite a bold move. But she wasn't a fan of Jeremy's TMI revelation, calling it too much too soon. Jen Tran spills what viewers didn't see during car confrontation. Jeremy's car was the center of drama later in the night. When he first pulled up at the mansion, he tossed the keys to host Jesse Palmer. This move came back to haunt him. Jeremy and Jen got in the car for a chat, but were interrupted by another contestant, Brian, who had gotten the car keys. Brian basically told Jeremy to get out of the car so he could have a moment with Jen. The Bachelorette confessed to Us Weekly that the situation was a hundred times more awkward in person than viewers saw on television. It also told her a lot about the two suitors. If two guys can't resolve a situation quickly, if it's going on for too long, I'm like, where are the problem-solving skills here? We're at a certain age where it is time to learn some problem-solving skills. Jen added that it is a major turnoff for her when men get involved or create drama. But she must have been willing to give both Jeremy and Brian a second chance as both men got roses. What did you think about the car confrontation between Jen's suitors? Share your reaction in the comments.